Hey guys, Technoman here with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you guys how to enable Pro Raw video capture on your iPhone and what that means and how you can enable and start using it today. But before we go ahead and get started, if you guys are new to our channel, we do a lot of tech news, reviews, and giveaways. So make sure to hit that subscribe. And also, if you guys are in the market for one of these phenomenal devices, make sure you guys check out the link in the description section. So, a couple things before you can actually use Pro Raw is first of all, you have to have an iPhone. 12 Pro or the 12 Pro Max. Those are the only two devices right now that has that feature and newer phones that probably come out after that. If you have the 12 mini or the regular 12 it won't work or any of the older generation of phones so that's first thing second thing is you want to make sure that you have ios 14.3 or later update on your phone and to check that you're going to go to settings and then general about and you'll notice here the software version we're at 14 dot five and if you need to update your software you can go to software update and look for our update here so 14.3 is the minimum that you'll need so as you can see there's a 14.6 out already so those are the two things you need iphone 12 pro or the 12 pro max and at least ios 14.3 or later and once you have done that you're going to go into settings and once you're in settings you're going to want to locate camera here so we're going to go down here to camera in the camera option we're going to select formats and in the format section you'll notice this new feature that's uh apple pro raw so what pro raw is that you know once you turn this on it will allow you to take photos in pro raw pro raw is basically a 12-bit file that used linear d and g format to retain more information and a dynamic range in the file containing additional flexibility when you're editing exposure and white balance um, each file is going to be larger it's going to be around 25 meg uh, to break it down in simpler terms is that it's able to capture uh, photos at more in depth um, and more of uh, more feature that allows you to edit the phone more to make it look more uh, realistic so to show you guys if we open up the camera app now this time you'll see that there's a raw up top here that it says so you, by default it's um, it has a cross over it because it's turned off to turn it on you're going to want to click do that um click on it and it'll say raw there and now to show you guys if you take a picture here and that's this picture is now as you can see here it's been in raw format and there's a label on the uh on the actual picture so if we take another picture here Same thing as you can see, this is the raw. And once you go to actually edit this, you'll get a lot more out of it, especially if you're editing the um, on your computer and such, you're able to do a lot more. You'll notice the contrast between a regular picture and a pro raw. There's a big difference because it's a bigger size photo and the way Apple is um, capturing it with the lens of the iPhone 12 Pro or the 12 Pro Max, it makes the picture look a lot more clear a lot more uh, actual solid stability to it and you'll notice the contrast between the light and the uh, exposure that it has almost like makes the photo a lot more cleaner of course if you're going to be taking a pictures in pro rot do note that it's going to take 25 meg so it could start filling up your uh, storage especially if you don't have a big storage capacity so hopefully this video is helpful if this video is helpful for you guys to understand pro raw and how to enable and use it make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button for all future tips and trick on your apple devices thanks for watching guys see you guys next time